Sorry, I was just rocking out there with my inflatable electric guitar. These are very expensive though. Well, I guess that's inflation for you. <laughs> inflation. Hello, it's the Magic Hatter here, coming to you live-ish through the magic of the internet. What a world we live in. I've become a high-tech hatter, and you can watch me now anytime you like through the medium of video. Ow, that really hurt. <laughs> Ow. You could watch me on your tablet. In fact, I brought mine here. There's my tablet. How do you get on videos on this? Is there an app? You have to get on the Wi-Fi, I think. Uh, the Wi-Fi, don't you? <laughs> you mm, can't get it working. I've cracked the screen down the middle. But hey, why are there no aspirins in the jungle? Because the paracetamol. <laughs> you could also watch me on your phone. I've got mine here. Hello. 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 What? Oh yeah, that's a bone. It's the old dog and bone. My phone's down here. Here it is. Oh. Hello. 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 It's a what? Oh, a cone. You're right, you know. And imagine the size of the ice cream in there. Wow. No, not an ice cream cone. Although I think I will have an ice cream, a little pre-show snack. Here's mine. Oh, it's pink. I think that means a uh, strawberry, which is a bit like strawberry, but I can't say strawberry. I've never learned how to say it. I'll just have a quick lick now. Mm. Oh, oh, my nose. Oh. Oh, that really hurt. It's one of those silly joke ice creams. Someone's playing tricks on me. Speaking of tricks, I've got lots of magic for you, and they say the show must go on. The show must go on, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't go, there won't be much singing in the show, but there will be lots of magic, and I need your help. You can join in with the magic words, you can wiggle your fingers, and between us we'll have lots of fun, lots of magic, and hopefully lots of laughter. So stay tuned, it's time for the show. Now, parents, before we start, you could also give myself and the Hatter family a little hand. Little hand, see? <laughs> you can cook food in this, it's a microwave. Virtual high five. <laughs> what I mean is, I am self-employed, so I've had to put my great big green thinking hat on to think of other ways that I can continue working, performing, and providing. So if you're in a position to donate anything at all, however big or small, the link is just here. It's also in the comments and on facebook.com slash magichatter. Anything that you can donate would help, but there is no pressure to donate. If you're struggling too, please just enjoy the show and have lots of fun with your family. You can also help by giving the video a share. Not that kind of share. If only I could turn back time. No, time to go share. What I mean is a share on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, the groups you're in. If you can help share this video far and wide, that can work magic too. Speaking of which, I think it's almost showtime. So sit back, relax, grab a yummy snack and your favourite drink, and I really hope you enjoy the show. Well, we can't have a magic show without saying a magic worm. Dead word. And my favourite is that one that begins with A or A. Ah. It's A. Ah, A. Ah. Do you know A? Ah. Have a banana. Yes, you're quite right. Have a banana. I love bananas. Shall I eat it now or save it for later? What's that? Not the magic word. Oh yeah, I was being silly. In fact, I was being bananas. I think I'll take it home and save it till later. And, uh, two bananas? I guess that's a banana split. <laughs> Maybe it was buy one, get one free. I'll put this one down here. What should I do with this one though? Any idea? I could eat it now. Good for energy bananas. You need lots of energy to do magic. I think I'll take it home and do it. Another one. What's going on? Right, so it's every time I put one down here, that is just one, isn't it? That's one banana. Keep your eye on the banana. I've gone off them now anyway. They've lost their appeal. <laughs> I'll put this one down there too. What's going on? Wait a minute, are you saying the right magic words at home? Maybe every time you say the magic word, that's when a banana appears. What was it? It was Hannah Montana. No, that's not right. It's, uh, you want some pajamas? What was it? It's something about a camera? What, uh, Ab Abba. Abba, the Swedish pop group. Oh, abracadabra, you're right. Not have a banana. <laughs> Dear me. Although, I've got so many bananas, maybe we should try some monkey magic. <laughs> Hello.
Hello, I'm back again, and I was hoping to show you some monkey magic, but the problem is I can't find my novelty fancy dress monkey ears anywhere. Have you seen them? I just can't find them. Now, where did I leave them? How annoying. Y what's that? Up there? Uh, no, I can't see them. Why would they be on the ceiling? Hmm? Oh, my head! Oh, so I suppose I must look like a monkey. How silly. <laughs> well, that reminds me. Two monkeys were in the bath. One turned and said to the other, the other one said, well, put some more cold in, because it was too hot. Yeah. Uh, what do you call a monkey with a firework? A ba-boom. <laughs> when I got my monkey ears, I thought we could use this banana to attract a monkey. All we need to do is waft it around, get the smell of the banana going, wafting, wafting. And maybe, oh, there's something small and brown and furry in there. Maybe it's one of those little spider monkeys. Oh, let's see. Oh, yep, here we go. A monkey. A little monkey there. Oh, it's a spider. Ah, don't like spiders. Ooh. Oh, it's okay. It's one of those toy spiders. I think I've seen those on the web. <laughs> no, that wasn't a monkey, though. I think we'll put the lid on and we'll try again. This time we'll make a monkey noise, which is, of course, mmm. No, that's not right. Um, it's. Oh, no, that's a giraffe. The elephant. Hey, two giraffes had a race. They finished neck and neck. What is a monkey sound? I made it earlier. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, yes, it's. <laughs> It will only work, though, if your grown-ups join in too. So, grown-ups, if you're sat watching, when I count to three, I want you all to make a great monkey noise. We'll use the banana like a magic wand. Here we go. One, two, three. Let's see. Oh, there's one more thing we need to do. Yes, we have to give the can a little tap. So, there's a little tap there. little tap. I find with comedy, the thing is not to force it. That was also a tap joke. That reminds me, I must cancel my tap dancing lesson. Let's give it a little tap. In fact, three. And that's the magic number. Let's see if we've managed to attract a monkey. Oh, go on then. One more time. Let's make the monkey sound. One, two, three. Let's see. Has it worked? No. This is just some, some green material. This is not a monkey. It's just a big gr Oh, hang on a minute. It's... Oh, I look like a monkey. Look at that. Well, I am always monkeying around. Thanks for helping with the monkey magic. Let's see what's next. <laughs> And now for one of the most famous tricks in magic, pulling a rabbit out of a top hat. All you need is a hat and a magic worm. Bad word. I've got the hat. Let's use the magic word we learnt earlier, which was abracadabra. Everyone on the count of three say abracadabra. One, two, three. Yes, let's see if it's worked. There's something in here. I think it must be a rabbit. Ta-da! It's a rabbit. Yeah. Wait a minute. This is a chicken. How did that get in there? I suspect foul play. Yeah, look at this. Poultry in motion. What about this one? Ooh, ooh. It's a poultry geist. Yeah, ugh. I think we need a different hat. Let's try this hat, my flat hat. I'm sure I saw a rabbit in there. Oh yeah, I can see the ears. Would you like to see the rabbit? Everyone say, show me the bunny, show me the bunny. Here's one ear, here's the other ear. And here is the rabbit from Top Hat. Ta-da! There it is. Yeah. Oh, phew, I thought I'd pulled the ears off a bunny there. That's not good. We shouldn't do that, of course. Inside is a rabbit. Smiling because he loves being on camera. He's a happy bunny. He's a d oh. Wait a minute. He doesn't look very happy. Everyone say, oh. It's like he's missing something. Oh, the ears. Yeah, you're right. Let's put the ears back on using magic. I do have a magic wand. Problem is, on the way here, I sat on the wand with my great big bottom and it broke. But I think I fixed it just in time. A massive magic wand. God, look at that. It's huge. When it broke, I put some glue in the end. I tapped it like that and now it is stuck on really firmly. So I can wave the wand around and what's that? No, no, it's fine. It's stuck on really firmly. And, uh, where's the end of the... One second. Oh, no! My wand! Maybe the glue was still wet. Well, 
I'll just be careful. What was I saying? Oh yeah, put the glue in the end, tapped it like that, that's better. Now it's stuck on really firm, it can't come off. So we'll wave the wand around and duh! Oh no, not again. I guess we'll just have to use a broken wand and hope for the best. Everyone say abracadabra. One, two, three, abracadabra. Let's see if it's worked. Hey, it's worked. Even with a broken wand, I can see the rabbit's ears are back on the picture. I'll show you. It's white. It's fluffy. Here is the rabbit complete with ears. Ta-da! How about that? It's, yeah. It's a duck, isn't it? Yeah. Ducks don't have rabbit ears. Maybe you could make a duck sound at home. Can you make a really good duck sound? <laughs> you sound quackers. I think we'll put it back in. Clearly something's gone wrong. That's what happens when you use a broken wand. Let's try a wand which is not broken. Uh, oh yes, here we go. How about this one? Perfect. Not broken. Absolutely do. I'm seeing spots. It's a spotty wand. Oh no, it's got wand pox. I know the cure though. You blow and the spots will disappear. Here we go. One, two, three. <gasps> and now they have completely disappeared. Right, what else do we need? Where are my instructions? Um, what's that? Spots? No, no, no. I blew and the spots disappeared, remember? You all helped. No, no, really, they're gone. It was only like five seconds ago. They've disappeared, see? Right, what we'll do is... Um, hmm? On the wand? No, it's spotless. There are no spots on the wand. It's absolutely fine. You. Spots everywhere. I really am seeing spots now. Well, let's try a spotty wand and just hope it works. You know the drill. One, two, three, abracadabra. One, two, three, abracadabra. Let's see if it's worked. I hope it has. Hey, it has. Just remember, rabbits can be all different colors, so this is just a black and white spotty uh, rabbit. There, see? Black and white spotty rabbit. How's that? There it is. It's a, it's a cow, isn't it? Yeah, you're right. Can you all make the sound of a cow? Hey, that's not very nice. I can hear people out there going boo, boo. Oh, you were saying moo. Well, I think it's time to move on. Let's put it back in. We need a wand which works. Oh, I've got just the wand. It's down here. This wand is made completely out of steel. This is my strongest wand. I've had this for 10 years. It has never, ever let me down. So this is the wand we'll use. And what's that? No, no, it can't. It's, it's made of steel. With this wand, hmm? No, no, it's not spotty. I already checked. It's a, no, no, it's got both ends. I already checked. It's fine. I can wave this wand in the air and you can way, yay, 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 whoa, dizzy. Hey, ooh. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, ow. And he broke my glasses. Oh, it looks like an elephant's trunk. Look at that. Can you all make the sound of an elephant? Let's try this wand. It might work. We'll wave it around. It's a bit hard to hit with. Everybody say abracadabra. One, two, three, abracadabra. <laughs> oh, I hope it's worked. We'll put the one down here. Let's see if it's worked. And yes, it has. Hooray. Give yourselves a round of applause. It's worked. Hmm? What's that? You want to see? Okay, I'll, I'll show you. There. Ta-da. There you go. Right. Let's move on. Next trick. Hmm? Okay, I will show you. I'm just messing about. Just remember, though, that... Uh, it's quite hot here in the studio, so the rabbit has turned a little bit pink. Yeah, that'll be the lights. That can happen. There he is. There's the rabbit, all pink because of the lights. Yeah. I know it's a pig, really. There's no fooling you. I was telling Porky's. It's a weird pig-rabbit thing. Can you make the sound of a pig? Brilliant. And thank you for not having it up. Yeah. Oh, what are we going to do? Oh, I think we need a really powerful wand. That's the only way this will work. I have a wand down here that's so powerful, it comes inside its own bag. And you have to keep the wand inside the bag or the magic might escape. But I think I'll show you it very quickly because it's made of silver. <gasps> wow, look at that, a solid silver wand. I will put it back in the bag though because what did I say might happen? Yes, the magic might escape. As long as you put it straight back in the bag, it's usually okay. Never take it out for more than five or 10 seconds and Oh, I forgot to push it down. I get so forgetful sometimes. Push it back down, sorry about that. Now what was I saying? Oh yeah, this wand is so powerful, it's bound to work with the... Hang on a minute. I'm sure I pushed it down, I did, didn't I? 
looks very strange. I think I'll keep my hand over the top, then I can see I have definitely pushed it down. That's better. So, duh. what's going on? This is very strange. I'll keep an eye on it this time. Okay, that's fine. Hey, whoop. that's fine. Good. Now, what the ha? Oh, I thought I'd catch it. I think you were just imagining the whole thing. I don't think it moved at all. It's fine, we'll leave it in there. And then, uh, oh, it's gone up my nose! It's gone right up my nose! Ah, it's gone up my nose! Ow! Oh, that really hurt. Ow. Oh, still works. We'll hold the wand upside down. Wands can't go down, they only go up in the air. We'll leave it in there and... Uh, this really is a powerful wand, and I've got a brilliant idea. Let's try using the wand outside the bag on full power. And we'll try that word again, abracadabra. Don't forget to give me a hand. On three, one, two, three, abracadabra. Let's see if it's worked. I'm just gonna move the wand because it's very expensive. Has it worked? Has it worked? Oh, something's happening. Something's happening. Let's see. Has it, let's see, has it worked? Yes, it's worked. The rabbit has his ears back. He's once again a happy bunny. Thank you for your help. That was hair-raising magic. <laughs> Being a hatter means I have many hats, so I thought now I would show you one of my more unusual hats, the hat I wear in bed. I call it my breakfast nightcap. I take the hat off in the morning, reach inside, and there's my breakfast. It's just down here, but it does look a little bit strange, so you have to promise now you won't laugh. In fact, don't even giggle, or I'll be very embarrassed. Yeah, I trust you. Here we go. Putting on the breakfast nightcap. No giggling, remember? Are you ready? Okay. Here we go. There it is. Yeah. Who's laughing? How rude. Yeah. No, it's okay. I know it does look quite silly. Hey, hang on. Yeah. Wait a minute. Come, come in. Come. Has it gone? Has it, has it gone? I don't mind if it's behind me. Now, inside this hat, there should be tomorrow's breakfast, a boiled egg. I will show you the egg, but first, first, I'm going to get rid of this hat and put a different hat on because I'm bound to have terrible hat hair. Just a second. Uh, oh, maybe let's go for, yeah, this one. <laughs> It's a chicken. What do you think? Let's see if the egg's inside. Oh, it is. Here it is. Now I can show you the mystery of the vanishing egg. It goes back inside the hat. It will disappear on the count of three. You won't have a clue where it's gone. Ready? One, two, three, and it has completely disappeared. Look at that. It's vanished from inside the nightcap. It's gone. It's amazing. It's miraculous. It's... Hmm? Under my arm? No, 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 it's not under my arm, it's vanished. Oh, the other one? No, not that one either. It really has disappeared. How's that? This one? No, not under that arm, and not under that arm. It has disappeared. Well, hey, hmm? this arm, I showed you this arm. Both arms, I, I did remember. Hmm? Which, okay, if you still think it's under this arm, and you want me to lift this arm in the air, Put your hand up like this. I'll check in a second if you... Oh, no it was. I snuck it under my arm. I was just pretending to do magic, but it really has gone. That is extraordinary. Where could it be? Well, that's tomorrow's breakfast. I need you to help bring it back. Everybody whisper, extraordinary. One, two, three, extraordinary. You can do magic, look. The egg is back in the hat. Give yourselves a pat on the back, that's amazing. I think I will show you the trick one more time, but this time no messing about. Ready? One, two, three. No, it has completely disappeared from inside the hat. It has gone completely. Hmm? No, it's not under my arm. No, it's not under that arm either. It has com completely <coughs> disappeared. It's vanished, you see? Ta da! No, it's not really in my mouth. I was pretending. I wouldn't really put a big egg in my mouth in case I swallowed it and choked. It's, uh, where could it have gone? That was just my tongue in my cheek. Let's try that. Everyone put your tongue in your cheek. Yeah, it looks a bit silly. Makes you talk funny. But I was just pretending. But we do need to find the egg because I need that for breakfast. Well, let's try again. Everybody whisper, extraordinary. Did you do it? It's not there. 
Oh, I think the second time you have to do something else. Can you make the sound of a chicken? And let's see those arms going as wings. That reminds me, I used to have a chicken-proof front lawn. It was impeccable. <laughs> Still not there. A bit louder this time. Ready? One, two, three. It's there! How about that? That is cracking entertainment. Well, it's hungry work magic, so I'm going to pause for a quick snack now. My favourite sweets. I love sweets. And I've got some jelly beans right here. Oh, I'm going to open them very carefully, though, because the last time I opened a can of jelly beans, a big silly snake jumped out and made me jump. So I'll open them carefully. Oh, I don't look. I don't look. Oh, that's fine. There's no snake in there. That's absolutely fine. There's a Spider though! Uh, a spider! Gah. I don't like spiders! Gah. I especially don't like snakes though. I'm just grateful there was no snake in there. <coughs> oh, there was a snake! Somebody magicked a snake in there after I'd opened it. I think someone's playing tricks on me. Although maybe I could magic some jelly beans. I just need a wand. The wand I've got down here was given to me by a very famous wizard called um, Barry Trotter. Have you heard of him? Barry... what was that? Oh, Potter, yeah. Larry Potter, the famous wizard. Harry. Yes, Harry Styles. That's what makes you beautiful. He doesn't sing like that, Harry Styles. Harry... what was it? Harry Hill, the comedian. He's hilarious. Harry... Potter. I should listen. Harry Potter. Well, before I can use this wand that was given to me by Harry Potter, I think I need to look more like him. I need to look more like a wizard. Um, he's got round glasses, hasn't he? I think I've got some round glasses. Just a sec. Whoa. Are they round enough? I can't see where the camera is now. Do you like my round glasses? Hi, my round glasses. Where are you? Are you there? I can't see a thing in these. Well, I think I might take them off. Yeah. Where are my other glasses? Just a second. I can't see now. That's better. Oh, they don't fit very well. What's going on? There we go. That's... What's that? The wrong way around. Oh, sorry. This way. Hey. Hmm? This way. What? Oh, the glasses are the wrong way. Yes, I'll turn them over. I can't see when I'm not wearing them. How's that? Is that better? Okay, so... Hmm? The, no, I turned them round. I just turned them over. Remember, I turn, did turn them round. Hmm? Oh, that way round. You're right, yes. Oh, they can't go that way. There's a bridge in the middle. It's this way. This way. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, ow. Oh, I think I'm okay. Just... Is that better? Don't worry, only my dignity is hurt. So I don't think I'll wear the round glasses, but I do need a wizard hat. Let me see if I've got a wizard hat. There's one down here. Ah, yes, this looks okay, I think. Yeah, what do we think? How's that? Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, that's lizard. You're a lizard, Harry. That's a lizard hat. That's not right. One second, I'll see if I've got a wizard hat. Oh yeah, this one might work. Ah, how's that? A wizard hat. I think we're ready to use the wizardy wand. Here it is, given to me by Harry Potter himself. And these look a bit like every flavour jelly beans. At least they would if there were any in there. Let's try the wand. We'll wave it over the top. And the smell, the spell, is Serpent Sorcerer. You can join in with me. One, two, three, Serpent Sorcerer. Serpent's a kind of snake, that's weird. It's, whoa, it's another snake! Oh no! <laughs> oh, let's get on with the next trick, quick! It is more important than ever to be kind at the moment. You could be kind to your brother and sister, share your toys, be helpful to your mum and dad. In fact, I've got a present for my mum just down here. I got it from the garden. I went out into the backyard and picked my nose. No, not nose. Picked some flowers. Not my nose. Ew. I'll show you the flowers. They're just down here. They are beautiful. I think you're going to like them. A beautiful bouquet of flowers. Blooming marvellous. Yeah. I'll just smell them to make sure they smell nice. I can't give my mum stinky flowers now, can I? Ah. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I'm allergic to flowers. They cause me to sneeze. 
Oh, I'm fine though. I'm cured. Hooray. Now, I think I need a vase and... I nearly sneezed. I'm fine though. The moment's passed. What we'll do is... Oh, God. I sort of half sneezed there. I didn't quite sneeze. I stopped it just in time. That's better. Oh, that was a little one. It's good. I'm fine. Oh, sorry, I did. I sneezed. I think I'll be okay though. Now it's out of my system. Oh, my flowers. Look at that. I sneezed so hard. I broke the flowers. Oh, no. Maybe it's just the stems. I'll just... There, that's better. <laughs> no harm done. I think I'll put these in a vase later and... Sorry about this. I think that's okay. Just be gentle. Easy does it. Easy. Okay. We're fine. So I need a vase and a bow and some water and... Oh no, look at these. I can't give those to my mum. They're all floppy and weird looking now. Okay, you can all help. Everyone wiggle your fingers. Let's try a magic word. Not abracadabra. Everyone say raise. Say raise. Ra keep saying it. Raise. 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 You made them raise up all by yourself, so it must be, wait for it, self-raising flower. <laughs> self-raising flower. Just pop those down when I get a tissue for my nose. Yeah, I did sneeze. Remember, hygiene. Who's Jean? Hygiene. I'll just get a tissue. Ah, oh, I hope I don't have a red nose after all that sneezing. No, I think I'm fine. Yeah, well, I do have a red nose. Do I look like that silly reindeer? What's his name? Uh, rhubarb. Rhubarb the red-nosed reindeer. No, not rhubarb. Uh, Randolph. Randolph. The, hmm? Was that Gandalf? He's a wizard. Santa, you shall not pass. <laughs> what was what it? Ruby? Rupert. No, he's a wonderful bear. Oh, Rudolph, you're right. Oh, I do have a red nose. Hang on. What's strange is I take it off and then... It still honks. Yeah. Well, at least I've got some flowers I can put in a vase and... Oh... I thought we'd fix those. Don't worry, I know what to do. I will make my mum some beautiful flowers. And for that, I need one of these. Do you know what this is? A, a baboon? No, a baboon's a big monkey. <laughs> we did the monkey bit earlier. It's a, a balloon. Yeah, I misheard you, sorry. Now, to put some air in the balloon, I think you blow it. <clears throat> it's not working. Oh, that's not how you blow it. You do have to stretch it first too. You have to stretch like this. Lots of stretching. It makes it easier to blow up like that. Lots of... Ah! <laughs> that really hurt. Ow. <sighs> okay, I don't think we need any more stretching. I will blow the balloon up the proper way. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh. Ow. Dangerous. I think maybe I'll use a pump. Yeah, I always use a pump and that's why I've got such big muscles. I can tell you're impressed. Here we go. Here is the pump blowing up the balloon. Here we go. Let's see. Do you think I could make my mum some beautiful flowers with a green balloon? That could be the stem. Wow. Look at that. That's huge. Massive. Oh, excuse me. Pardon me. I will tie a cannot in the end of the balloon so the air can't... Hmm? No, I can't say not. I always say cannot. No, I didn't. I did not. Well, I did that time, but that's a different kind of knot. Here we go, tying the balloon. And then, when it's all tied, you twist and you fold and... Where did it go? Oh, I forgot to tie the cannot in the end. I'll try again. This time, remind me to tie the cannot. <laughs> Right, here we go. Tying the canot once, twice, and thrice. And that's French for three times. Yeah. Now I have something green. I can show you the amazing things I can make. Brace yourself. It's a cucumber. How's that? Cucumber? It's quite good. Or a green bean. Any long green vegetable I can do, really. Uh, okay, maybe something better. How about um, an animal? Uh, snake, S snake there. I can do a caterpillar, caterpillar. Look at that. Handlebar moustache. Hello, hello, hello. Mm, um, worm, do a worm. No, I think we can do better. Maybe the world's fastest balloon dog. Finished. It's a hot dog. A mouldy green one. Ew. No, that's not right. I could do a monster behind my back. Watch this. A monster. Finished. Would you like to see? 
That's the Loch Ness Monster. It's Nessie. I had to go to Blue University to learn that one. That's how good that is. No, you're right. It doesn't look very good. Maybe I need ah, some twists. And then I've made my mum a, an aeroplane. What is that? It's kind of weird. Oh, I think we need something else. My mum's favourite colour is red. So let's try and make something red and green. What could I make? Maybe some flowers. Let's hope so. Blowing up the balloon. Here we go. Remind me to tie that knot in the end again. Here we go. Whoa, it's a big one. Okay. We'll tie it neatly like this so the air does not escape. Now we have a long red balloon, and this time we tie the ends together to make a squircle. If you know your shapes at school, you'll be familiar with a squircle. It's educational, this channel, too. Tying the ends together. Here we go. It's fiddly, it's fiddly. Perfect. Now I have made a picture frame. Hi. Picture frame there. Or a number... A number eight. Or um, how about a bow? Ah, a bow. Or some glasses. Hello. Hello. Or some ears, like Mickey Mouse. Oh, hi. Hello. Or um, what else? A Mario moustache. Hello, it's -a me, Mario. Woohoo. Oh, what else could it be? I have no idea. What do you think? What could it be? Oh, it could be a pair of lips. Look at that. Like Mick Jagger. <laughs> I can't get no satisfaction. That's not my best impression. How about, oh, I know. A toilet seat. What do you think? Shall I give my mum a red toilet seat? No, I don't think so. I think we need to fold it here, twist it here, and now I've got to cross. Oh, X Factor, X Factor. Maybe if I put these two together, what do you think it might be? That's right, a flamingo. No, an octopus. No, I've forgotten. Let's see. We'll stick it together. We don't even need any gloopy glue. Oh, it's noisy. It's squeaky. It's noisy. Oh, but there we have a beautiful flower for my mum. Look at that. And this is a little act of kindness. Oh, I won't smell this one in case I start sneezing again. What do you think of the flower? I think I'll give it to my mum. I'll say you can look after this, show it to all of your friends, and then you can pin it on your living room wall. Yeah. No! Bad idea. Well, I think it's time to see what's next. Enjoy the rest of the show. Uh-oh. <laughs> Now, as you can see, I've changed my hat for this artist hat, which I'm sure you'll agree is a very nice hat. Very. And it reminds me of Frank Spencer. Oh, Betty, I got a bit of trouble. Kids won't get that, but parents, if you're of a certain age, you might. I'm going to do some art, which is why I'm dressed like this, and I'm going to show you the world's biggest colouring book. Speaking of world records, I have actually broken a record too. It's just here. Has anyone got any smeller tape? Yeah, it's a bit like sellotape, but I can't say sellotape. Uh, hey, five, four, three, two, one. It's the vinyl countdown. <laughs> Moving on. Here it is, the world's biggest colouring book. It's absolutely massive, and I'm going to show you just how good I am at colouring in. Yeah, let me just check, see how good it looks. Yeah, mm. It does look good, but I've mainly coloured in white crayons today. Yeah, see? White crayons there. You see that? Lots and lots of, of white. Um, you, you don't seem very impressed. Is, is that good? How's that? Is that all right? No, you're right. I haven't done any colouring at all. I need some paint and one of those brushes you paint with them. Oh, a paintbrush. Yeah, I've got one down here. A paintbrush. Ah, yes. There is a paintbrush. What's that? A hairbrush? What, for combing small bunnies? Yeah, no, for this hair. Oh, it's rubbish. Doesn't work. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, paintbrush, paintbrush. Oh, no, here it is. There is my paintbrush. How's that? What's that? A toothbrush? Wow, look at the size of it, though. It must belong to a giant. Although I'm scared of giants, I've got fee fi phobia I have, yeah. Let's see, uh, paintbrush, oh no, it's here. There it is, my paintbrush. How's that? It's a what? A toilet brush? Oh, ew, gross. Okay, none of those were paintbrushes. Oh, what about this one? This looks good. Is that a paintbrush? Yes, it's got the fuzzy bits on the end and the handle on the other... No, the handle's on that end and... No, the... Wait a minute. 
Oh, it's double sided. It looks like a moustache. Hello, hello, hello. No, that's not right. Well, you know, I don't think I've got any paintbrushes or even any paint. How am I going to paint without any paint? Oh, maybe you could help. I've got a brilliant idea. You could all throw some colours towards the book on the count of three. But very important, only throw them at the book, okay? Do not throw them at me. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, what is that? There's something in my ear. What? Hey, wow, look at that. Oh, it tickles. Wow, lots and lots and lots of colours from my ear. Did you throw them at me? Wow, it's like a rainbow of colours. Look at that. Maybe we could paint with these colours. What do you think? Let's give it a go. Usually takes me about an hour, so sit tight. No, not really. I think it might have already worked. Let's see. Is it coloured in? Let's have a... Yes, it's all coloured in. It looks really good. Hooray! <laughs> no? You, you want to see? Okay, I will show you, but I was rushing a bit. It usually takes me longer. Let's have a look. How's that? What do you think? It's, it's all coloured in. <laughs> a scribbly mess? Yeah, that does look a bit scribbly. You're right. I think we can do better. What do you think? Maybe we need some... Oh, I know. I've got some colourful handkerchiefs down here. They're a bit like handkerchiefs, but I can't say handkerchief. I just don't know how. Who knows what colour this is? I am not mean. Oh, green. Yes, you're right. What about this one here? Bread? No, no, I think you're wrong. This is bread. See? Bread. I'd like to raise a toast. Hmm. Oh, red. Yeah, you're right. I should listen. What about this one? That's not very nice. You're going boo, boo. Oh, blue. Yeah. And what about this one? You must know this one. Oh, yes. Hello. Hi. What colour is this? Hello. Hi there. Hello. Oh, yellow. Yeah. Well, let's find a magic bag. I've got one here. Uh, ah, yes. Magic bag. We'll drop the colours inside and they will completely disappear and reappear on the book. In they go. All the way in. Perfect. And wow, they've already disappeared. E Ew. I must have missed. That's strange. I'm usually a good shot. In they go. Sorry about that. Clumsy me. So, what... Ah. Did they jump out? That's very strange. What's going on? Let's just... Whoa. Hey, oh, I think there's a hole in the bag. Oh, it's a zip. Let me just do the zip up. Zip. That's better. In they go. Now the colours will disappear. Abracadabra. Disappear. Oh. Oh, we need a wand. Yeah. I've got a wand down here. I think I've got the perfect wand for this. If you remember earlier, I had a spotty wand, a broken wand, a bendy wand. But this wand is not broken, is not bendy, is not spotty, is not... Oh. It's got a great big knot in. Look at that. Well, I hope it works. Everybody whisper abracadabra. Let's see if it's worked. I hope it has. No, they're still in there. Nothing's happened at all. I'll take them. Hey, look at this. They're all tied together in knots. I could make some, some bunting or a nice big scarf. Look at that. La, 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 la. No, not really. It's not a scarf, but we need the colours to disappear, not be tied together. I think we need a different wand, one which is not knotty. I've got one down here. Uh, ah, this is actually not a wand. It is a magic paintbrush. I know what you're thinking. It looks nothing like a brush, but... Like a brush, I think. And this is what we do. We stir like this, put some colours on, put some colours on, and for the magic to work, everyone say abracadabra. Ah. <laughs> Let's see if it's worked. I hope it has. No, they're still in there. Nothing's happened. Oh, look at that. The colours have completely disappeared. Wow. But if the colours have gone and the bag's empty, where could they be? It's a mystery. I'm absolutely flummoxed. Oh, in the book. Let's see if they're in the book. I hope so. Yes, they are. Ta-da. Oh, I'll show you, really. If they're coloured in, you need to give yourselves a big clap and a pat on the back. Let's see. Oh, look at that. They are completely coloured in. It's magic. Thank you for helping with this colourful conjuring. It's time for me to find a new hat, and it's time for the next trick. Well, hey!
This is a great time to try a new skill or learn a new hobby. I've taken up jigsaws. I completed one which only took me six months to finish, which was great. Yeah, it said four to six years on the box. <laughs> well, hey. Uh, and what else have I tried? Oh, tap dancing. But I had to stop that. I kept falling in the sink. Ouch. But I've also taken up the Rubik's Cube, that 80s gem. I've got mine here in this box. I'll show you. Keeping it safe, here is my Rubik's Cube. Oh, wrong side, so it's in this side. Here is my Rubik's Cube. Where is it? Where's it gone? I had a. Oh, sorry, my mistake. It's down here. One second. Noisy box. Here it is. Ah! This is a very rare, completely brown Rubik's Cube. It's brown on every side. Look at that. Hmm? Oh, a box, yeah. This might be a box, you're right. Oh, here it is. A Rubik's Cube. Look at that. Perfect. I've completed it on every side. It looks great. Hmm? No, I haven't really completed it. I'm not actually very good at the Rubik's Cube. It's really hard. Maybe I should stick to magic instead. In fact, I'm going to see if I can make this Rubik's Cube completely disappear. It goes inside the box, I put the lid on, a magical click, and it's disappeared. Thank you. <laughs> Easy magic. Hmm? No, it really has. It's disappeared. Well, I'll show you. It's disappeared. Look, it is not in there. It has completely vanished. The other side. No, I'll show you the other side as well. It really has completely vanished from the box. It's amazing. That side, I already showed you that side, but I'll show you again because I don't mind. There you go. It's vanished, disappeared. Look at that. The, the other, I've showed you that's more doors. Um, okay, I'll open that door. How's that? See, vanished. It's gone. Hmm? More doors. Uh, okay, how about that one? It's disappeared, it's a miracle. Hmm? Another one. Okay, maybe one more, just uh, that one. How's that? It's gone. Hmm? With the last door. All right, if you want me to open the last door, shout really loudly at the screen. Oh, I was afraid you'd do that. Okay, I will show you, but there's a chance I was just cheating, tipping the box from side to side. Okay. Yeah, I know. I know it's still there. I... Wait a minute. It really has gone. Where's the Rubik's Cube? That's really strange. Sometimes I surprise myself. I really do. Where... In here? No, it came out of that box. It can't be in here. That would be impossible. Let's have a look, though. Oh, hey. Look at this. The Rubik's Cube is... Back in the box. Not bad for an 80s retro toy. I've got love for you if you were born in the 80s. The 80s. Well, it's almost the end of the show now, but as you've watched so well and joined in brilliantly, I thought I would show you my favourite magic hat, which is this green one right here, what I've taken off my head so you can have a closer look. But very important, please don't say any magic words, especially abracadabra. Once people started saying magic words and all these silly things started happening, so please don't say... What was that? Did, did someone out there say abracadabra? No, I'm sure you didn't. I Wait a minute. Someone has made sausages appear in my hat. Okay, very funny. No more magic. Hey. Hang on. Whoa. <laughs> wow. Okay, let me just flag this up. No more magic words, please. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, very funny. Please, though, that's enough. The hair. Not again! Okay, I'm pretty sure that's everything. You can't possibly still... Hang on a minute! Oh, that must be the big finale. Nothing could top that. Okay, that's the end. Wait a minute. Are you still saying abracadabra? Oh no! Hang on a minute. Whoa! Hey! Okay, that's enough now, please. <laughs> Wait, there's something else in here. Oh no. Do you want to see what's in here? Oh, I'm not sure I heard that. Do you want to? Oh, okay, I'll show you then. Let's have a look. What could it be? Here we go. It says the end. 
that is the end of the show. Well, that is the end of the show now. I hope you've had as much fun watching as I've had making it. And I do plan to make more videos too. So parents, be sure to click that subscribe button on YouTube. And you can also follow at facebook.com slash magichatter for updates. Remember to stay giggly, find the fun and the magic every day, and stay awesome. Now it's time for me to disappear. And I think I'll take the lift today. Bing! Mm. Uh.